I've been wanting to discuss the announcement of season two for this fool, a show I got interested in because of ads on YouTube. And I watched the show with my dad and it was very enjoyable. As someone who is half Mexican, everything just hits home with me. The characters are relatable. Even the ex of Julio reminds me of someone in my life. The first season was written very well. Something I knew that would help keep the show alive and bring new viewers was Jimmy Kimmel. When he brought Chris Estrada, one of the creators and actors of the show, and Frankie Quinones on Jimmy Kimmel Live. Honestly, they should put Guillermo on the show since they probably now have a connection with Jimmy Kimmel. Frank Frankie Quinones, a while back in November, posted on his Instagram that season two of This Fool is coming soon. I will read this article provided thanks to Variety.com and Selome Hailu. Hulu has renewed This Fool for a second season. The half hour comedy is set in working class South Central Los Angeles. The show centers around Julio Lopez, a 30 year old who still lives at home has been dating his girlfriend on and off since high school and finds any excuse to avoid dealing with his own problems. Julio works at Hugs Not Thugs, a gang rehabilitation nonprofit where he butts heads with his older cousin Luis, an ex-gang member who just got out of prison and has moved in with Julio and his family. The cast also includes Laura Patalano as Julio's mother, Esperanza, Michelle Ortiz as his girlfriend Maggie, Julia Vera as his grandmother, Maria, and Michael Imperioli as his boss, Minister Payne. The 10 episode first season premiered on August 12, 2022. In her positive review, Variety chief TV critic said that the show is smart to lean into what sets itself apart from the rest of that well-trod genre, making it feel much fresher a take than most thanks to its specificity and focus on Latino and formerly incarcerated characters. Hailing from ABC Signature, This Fool is written an executive producer Produced by Estrada, Pat Bishop, Jake Weissman, and Matt Ingot Bretson, Jonathan Groff, and Fred Armisen. Also executive produce. Bishop Weissman and Inge Bretson were the co-creators of the Comedy Central series Corporate. With Weissman and Inge Bretson also starring Estrada appeared in the corporate episode Pickles for Breakfast, with most of his prior experience being in stand-up comedy.